guys welcome back welcome to my channel i'm morgan and today i'm doing a vlog currently tuesday october 29th and it is 6 50 a.m i'm letting my dog out right now but i have school today but we have an early dismissal so we get out at literally 11 20 and the day starts at 9 45 so i'm not even in there for two hours and i have one class and then i have a study hall and then i go home kind of the most pointless day ever but it's fine i'm still going because might as well so yeah and then i get to come home and today i'm really excited i'm gonna carve my pumpkin today we're gonna have a cozy fall day this whole week is gonna be very festive because tomorrow i'm gonna be baking some pumpkin muffins because i'm selling them at my art club halloween festival thing we're doing on halloween i'm not going to the actual festival i don't think but i am just baking muffins like pumpkin muffins for it i'm gonna bake those tomorrow and then bring them on thursday for that and then on Thursday is Halloween, which my friend and I are going to paint pumpkins on Halloween. We're going to give out candy and stuff. I'm just really excited to give out candy. I love seeing little kids' costumes. And my friend and I were going to dress up, but we never figured out a costume. So I don't know what we're doing, really. I'll probably just throw something together. But yeah, today's going to be a very easy day. I also have to go to the grocery store because we did not go at all this weekend. I ended up having to go into work yesterday at my mom's work which I don't usually work on Mondays, I usually just work Sundays from 10 to 2, but yesterday someone called out and my mom was only working with one other person and she needed someone else because the weekdays are busier, so I had to come in from 2.15 to 7. I also, last night, I had the, because I wanted something kind of quick for dinner because we didn't get home until like 7.30, and I also just didn't have anything else to make because like I said, we haven't been at the grocery store in a while, so I made the Trader Joe's soup dumplings chicken soup dumplings and i tried them for the first time and they're so good i would definitely recommend also tried two pieces of the kimbap like the frozen kimbap from trader joe's and it was really good so i'm just like rambling but my dog is not getting up i let i open his crate but he's not coming out and let's go outside this whole time for some reason i was thinking i had to walk home from school but i just realized my bus will take me home because i'm getting out at the same time as everyone else. I will see you guys later. I'm probably gonna just wear a very chill outfit today because I really don't care what I look like. Oh, and also, I desperately need to edit today. I literally have to edit an entire video and get it uploaded because it's Tuesday and I upload on Wednesdays and I don't have a video. So I'm currently reading Butcher and Blackbird. I finished the Pumpkin Spice Cafe yesterday. It was really cute. I gave it like a three stars. It was a cute, like the vibes of it were super good for fall. But I didn't really feel too much chemistry between the two main characters. I don't know why. That's probably just me personally, but it was a cute book. But yeah, I'm starting Butcher and Blackbird. I'm really excited. I've heard really good things, so I like it so far too. Guys, I just went grocery shopping and they literally have my beloved Japanese sweet potatoes now at my local grocery store. Usually I could only get them at Trader Joe's, but I just found them at my grocery store. Like how long have these been here? Because they're kind of in a different spot like that I never really look at. I'm so happy. I'm gonna give you guys a haul of everything I got. So like I said, they literally have Japanese sweet potatoes now. Like best day of my life. I only got one, but the rest of them kind of look bad. Got some spinach, Brussels sprouts, mushrooms. These are all for my dinner tonight. Some cottage cheese. Usually I like good culture, but they didn't have any, so I got this brand. This brand's not bad either, though. Then I got snap peas, and those are for the peanut noodles that I like to make because I finally got more of these brown rice noodles from Acme. They only sell them at Acme near me. I don't go there often, so I haven't had them in a while. And I got the best Greek yogurt ever. Lastly, two bananas and a tomato. These are for smoothies and then this is for my lunch. Oh yeah, I really only just got stuff I really needed like for today. I can't believe it's literally only like 12.30 and I got out of school at 11.20. Like it was, oh, I didn't even talk about school, but it was like the most pointless thing ever. Like I barely did anything. It is time for me to edit. Like I need to lock in finish this video. All right, I'm gonna have a snack right now while I'm editing. And I bought some fresh Honeycrisp apples at 
the pumpkin patch I went to this weekend or the orchard or whatever and I also bought pumpkin spice peanut butter I can't show the brand because it's like a local brand thing and like I'm not trying to reveal my location but I'm really excited to try it and I'll let you guys know my thoughts like if you know me I love peanut butter so like a pumpkin spice peanut butter like so fun for fall so I'm excited to try it all right let's do a taste test should I try the peanut butter itself try it a little bit Okay. I can taste a hint of like pumpkin spice. Like it definitely still tastes pretty much predominantly like peanut butter. I'm getting a hint of pumpkin-y vibes. Let's try it with the fresh honey crisp apple. I don't even know if I've ever had a honey crisp apple. I probably have. Actually I don't think this is a honey crisp. It's not a honey crisp. I forget. Sorry. Whatever it is, it's very good. Alexa, play Sabrina Carpenter. So I'm thinking about making this pasta sauce, but I'm almost scared because like I don't like red sauce, like regular tomato sauce or whatever. But I've heard this one's really good, but I'm kind of scared of it. Ooh, it smells really tomato saucy. So I actually don't know if I'm gonna like that. Mm -mm. I can't tell if I, mm. it literally just tastes like tomato sauce. I don't think I can eat that. I feel like if I liked tomato sauce, this would probably be good, but I really just don't do well with tomato sauce. So I think, I don't know what to do with this. I wanna make pasta, but I don't really have enough pesto. So I might just make a salad. I can't believe I got this at my grocery store. Oh, I'm trying to cut it backwards. I'm gonna be buying these like all the time now. You're gonna get sick of it. This is a blessed day. Hot. I can't believe I have these locally. Okay, I just found my pumpkin carving kit and I'm gonna carve a pumpkin. Pretty much hollowed out so we're gonna start carving i haven't looked for a design yet but i kind of want to do snoopy i'm gonna look on pinterest Dressed. I never know what to wear because it's literally 50 degrees right now, but it's going up to 76. school but for me after school is different than everyone else so my art club is at three to four then when I get home from that I have to bake muffins for my art club too because we're doing like a Halloween fest on Halloween which is tomorrow which is crazy I can't believe Halloween's tomorrow so I have to bake some pumpkin muffins I'm wearing this top from Brandy and then I'm gonna wear I don't know what pants I'm wearing yet but I'll show you guys later I did get my video edited and uploaded so that's good that was out today. I've been just so behind on editing. Like, I keep editing like so last minute. So my videos are very like 
up to date like like when you're seeing this it's gonna be saturday and i'm filming this literally like the wednesday before breakfast is made i'm gonna eat and probably read butcher and blackbird i'm enjoying it so far like the plot is exciting so far i mean i'm not that far into it how far am i 28 percent. that's pretty relatively far about a third back from my art club and then i just went on a walk but i'm going to bake the pumpkin muffins right now i'm really excited because i bought really cute little baggies to put them all in basically they're i'm selling them at our art like halloween festival for art club so i got these cute little bags from the dollar store to put them in like individually wrap them so i'm gonna do half the muffins with chocolate chips and then half without so i'll do one of these types of bags for the chocolate chips and then one for no chocolate chips. This recipe has like a scary amount of sugar <laughs> like it just looks like insane gross and like clumpy I'm making pasta for dinner because they finally had the pesto at my grocery store today. And I'm so excited. Oh my god, it looks so pretty outside. It's like glowing pink in here. Wait, I need to look out the other window. Ooh, it's so pretty. But yeah, I'm so happy my muffins turned out. So cute. But yeah, these are the plain ones and then the chocolate chip are over there. I made my beautiful pasta. So we're gonna eat and I'm probably gonna read or actually, I don't know, I might want you to. Just worked on some of my dual enrollment class. Oh, I never showed you guys, but I put all my muffins in the little baggies. I'll insert a picture of it because I already put them away in like big bags. Currently 8.48, so I'm gonna make a yogurt bowl right now. I can't believe how Halloween is tomorrow. I literally don't even have a costume. I also got more poppies. I got this new flavor to try, I'm so excited. I got these literally all for free because my dad works at a storage company where they store poppies and I'm really excited to try this new cranberry fizz one. Cause like my dad like met the owner and she like keeps giving me all these poppies for free and it's amazing because i don't know because i've never really had like cranberries but we'll see it's literally 5 30 and there's already trick-or-treaters so i legit just threw on the most awful outfit with this headband and that's my costume but time to give out candy my friend can't even come because she doesn't feel good so it's just me I officially retired from my Halloween post. Like, there's really no more kids. It's 8.07. There really weren't that many kids in total. I feel like there were mainly a lot at the beginning and then it kind of just like wasn't that many. But it was still fun. It would have been way more fun if my friend was over. It was kind of boring just like being there alone. But that's okay. I hope everyone else had a great Halloween. Comment down below what your favorite Halloween candy is. I don't know. I really like Reese's. 
but I also feel like Almond Joys are very underrated in like Halloween candy things, so I do like those as well. I have some candy left over. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, Girl Scouts.